All right, we'll take questions for Avalanche goaltender Pavel Francos. Start with Peter Baugh, the athletic. Hi, Pavel. Um, I guess just to start, what was your level of rust having not played in like a game action in quite a while? And how do you feel you did kind of as the game went on? Uh, yeah, I mean, it was a game in uh, more than a year for me. So uh, for sure, it was uh, quite quick in the start. Uh, it was like the worst start I could ever wish for. First shot, post, a rebound goes in. and uh, But uh, uh, I was just trying to stick with it. And uh, I felt better and better with every stop, every save, uh, with every moment. So as the game went on, I, I started feeling pretty normal. I felt, I felt really good in the second period. Any other questions for Pavel? Evan Rall, Dan VR. Yeah, Pavel, how much of this preseason is really just going to be, I guess, being patient, you know, getting your timing back for everything that's considering how much time you've missed? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I, I, I know I was uh, far from being perfect today and uh, I didn't even expect myself to be perfect on the first game. And uh, I think it's just, it's just still a process and uh, we're, we're aiming for the start of the season. So uh, that's kind of my, my thought. All right, thank you, Pavel. Yeah. yeah, thank you. All right, we'll take questions for Avalanche head coach Jared Bednar, Peter Baugh, The Athletic. Hey, Jared, just to start, um, your general thoughts on how, how the team played and maybe players who, who stood out and maybe, I guess, popped a little bit tonight in your eyes. Yeah, I thought the team played hard, you know, like uh, we put ourselves in some penalty trouble that, that ended up catching up to us, but I thought we played hard. We were pretty good in the structure of our game. It wasn't the cleanest game, but um, we were good on the four check. We had some work to do in the D zone. Um, our puck moving was sort of inconsistent, but uh, for the most part, I thought our guys played pretty well. Um, Val Nachushkin stood out for me in a real good way. I thought he was maybe the best player on the ice in the first period. On the back end, I like Jack Johnson a lot. I like Bo Byram a lot. Um, Justin Barron was solid. Up front, you know, Magna had a good night. He created some chances. Um, I said Val, OC worked hard. Uh, Shane Bowers is much improved. Nick Henry's much improved from last time we saw some of these guys. So I think there's quite a few positives um, overall from the game. You know, that was, wasn't an easy lineup to play against from Vegas tonight. And I thought some of our young guys did a real nice job. Olison looked good again. Looks like he's getting more confident, getting used to the lack of time and space on the smaller ice. And um, yeah, so he, he, he scores a nice goal tonight and he made some plays and a lot of positives to take from tonight's game. Go ahead again, Peter. Yeah, um, with Jack Johnson, you mentioned him first, obviously. What impressed you specifically about the way that he played and I guess how much trust are you gaining in him as this preseason camp has gone on? Well, as you'd expect from a veteran player, I mean, he, he knows what's coming at him. He knows how to read the forecheck. He was making plays to get us in and out of our zone. 
makes a great play on the regroup where he spins off a guy, advances the puck, and then Val put it over to Olison for the first goal. Um, he was shooting the puck. He got a few blocked, but he kept hammering away, and we ended up getting the goal off the face off because of his shot. You know, I think he's in on a couple of those goals for and um, solid defensively. His gaps were good. He was physical. He was 